23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening, I'm Alex Fell. Here's what's making headlines. If you're planning to celebrate the holiday, be sure to keep your lovebirds safe for Valentine's Day, that is. The CDC rolled out some new rules for Valentine's Day celebrations as the pandemic drags on. Of course, large gatherings are discouraged, but CDC says that you can do a virtual night on Zoom if you really miss that special someone this year. And another suggestion, of course, is always to send some flowers or a Valentine's Day card to the people that you miss. It's a safe and easy way to let them know that you care. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame just announced its 2021 nominees. 16 artists and bands are on the list, including Mary J. Blige, Kate Bush, Devo, The Foo Fighters, The Go-Go's, Jay-Z, Carole King, and Tina Turner. Artists are eligible if their first commercial recording was released at least 25 years ago. The inductees will be announced in May. As efforts to get kids back in school ramps up, so does the push to get teachers vaccinated. Now, the Bakersfield City School District says that it's requesting 300 doses of the vaccine for its employees. Those shots will go to staff or 65 and older in order to align with the county's current vaccination criteria. BCSD says it understands the vaccine supply is limited, but the district thinks this is a necessary step in getting students back to school. Brandon. Wind still a little bit stronger in eastern Kern County right now. 22 mile per hour gust in Tehachapi, 20 miles per hour in Rosamond. Ahead of our next system, though, we are expecting another increase in our winds that we'll talk about shortly. In general, though, sunny to start the day off tomorrow. A little bit more cloud cover into the afternoon. 65, your high temperature in Bakersfield, some 70s over in the desert, although we are going to be cooling down. Cold front moving in. Early Friday is going to give us a couple of showers. Could see some showers ahead of that system as well into Thursday night and some lingering activity into the weekend with another system cooling down into the upper 50s for us. By the weekend, even bigger drop in our temperatures for the mountain communities into the 40s by Friday and back to the 40s again on Sunday. And that's your latest news and weather update. Have a good night, everyone.